Manhattan hiker was trapped in Tanker Verde Falls, suffering from severe dehydration today. Sh sheriff's deputies airlifted the hiker so they could uh, provide treatment. Not in your sides, Priscilla Casper was there and shares just how long before a hike you should prepare. A Pima County Sheriff's helicopter called into action to retrieve a hiker in Upper Tanky Verde Falls this afternoon. We can't show you the hiker's face because he's a minor. Pima County Sheriff Sergeant Eric Maldonado says the hiker was about two miles in and suffering from heat-related illness. His friend had called in uh, on his behalf and said that his buddy was experiencing some significant de dehydration issues. Uh, he was vomiting, uh, felt dizzy, felt like he couldn't walk or, or stand on his own. Sergeant Maldonado says with the current heat wave, they are experiencing more rescue missions. We're one of the busiest uh, counties in the state of Arizona, if not the busiest uh, county in the state of Arizona for search and rescue missions. He says last year they had about 231 search and rescue operations and are on the same pace for that record number this year, if not break it. He advises anyone planning on hiking, hydrate 24 to 48 hours in advance, pack enough food and water for the entire day, give someone your itinerary, and always hike with a friend. I spoke to one of the friends who was with that hiker and he tells me that they each had about one to two bottles of water and the sheriff's department says that is definitely not enough when you are going on a hike during these hot conditions. Reporting on the east side, Priscilla Casper, KGA 9 on your side.